Welcome back. This is Latrell with Banks and Eddie's on the review of the Bonafide 127 SS that I got from Westbrook a few days ago. Uh, I'm going to go over some of the key features with this boat for you in case if you're looking for one. Uh, first thing we're going to start off with is the paddle. The paddle that I have here is an uh, Aquabound Mount Array Hybrid. Um, if you're getting a, into the kayak business, make sure you get a decent paddle that can save your body and your life out on the water. Here we have the Bonafide 127SS. Bonafide makes these kayaks in several models. This is the biggest of them all. Currently you can see that the seat is in the low seating position. I will be sitting in the high seating position today. Here we have the front hatch. It opens from both ends. And this is where you would keep your paddle. The hull of the kayak goes all the way to the back so you're able to store full size rods or any gear if you're going on a trip. Clothing, food can all fit comfortably in the front side of your kayak. When seated on the kayak, you can open the front hull from the seating position. Reach inside, grab your lunch, extra tackle, whatever you need. Right in front of the seat, we have a dry storage. We can pop it up. Open it up on the inside. Enough room to keep your cell phone, extra batteries, whatever you need for your trip during the day. A lot of people convert this box into a fish finder. They put their fish finder right here on top. Batteries stored inside so they won't get wet. And it's right in front of your face, ready for a long day of fishing. This box is completely removable. So if you wanted to have one for one day, you're just out paddling on the lake, having fun with family. Or if you wanted to do another one that was set up with a fish finder on it, you can have two and they're fairly inexpensive. This will be my seating position for the day. It's close to sitting in a recliner in the living room, maybe a few inches short very comfortable for long day fishing here in the back of the kayak there's enough room for storage for several poles and um, this is a yak gear crate that I've made I bought this little pole holder from Walmart for about 10 bucks put it together zip tied it to the crate so that's all we have for today never forget about your paddle guys your paddle is one of the most important things about the kayak it will make or break you, make you have a good day or a bad day. Make sure you invest in that good paddle brand. All right, guys, we're about to take this Bonafide 127 SS out on the water here. We're on Lake Lanier, six mile, and hopefully we're gonna get on some good fish today. That will be a separate video coming for you. All right, first ride in the Bonafide. Get adjusted. There we go. Second time standing. I'm gonna try not to use my hands this time. Nice and smooth. All right, guys, I'm gonna unstrap the GoPro. All right, so that was a little cumbersome there. Woo, get a little shaky, but totally stable. Um, I think I could cast comfortably. 
I've only been in the kayak for maybe an hour, hour and a half. The day has turned for the better. Beautiful fishing day. Beautiful place. Beautiful kayak. So very stable. Um, if I could stand in it, I'm pretty sure anyone could. So if you guys are in the market for a kayak, I would definitely say check out the Bonafide. Um, give it a test drive. Uh, if you want to try mine, feel free to reach out to me. Um, I'll meet you up somewhere, let you paddle it around, see what you think. Thank you guys.